This is the second day I'm treating. Treating day. Last night I had a take. But it resulted in nothing. I think it were a tench. It's constantly rained all the time we've been here. It's looking good for nature though. Really good. Yeah, the tech I <laughs> the, the the tech I had were, were on a stiff hinge, and it, it was it was ten shape. It, it was it, it was like picked it up and couldn't quite get it in his mouth. It just typical tench tench by, but there's some good tension in. I won't mind having a nice tench out to be honest with you. I'll show you show you a place. I know it's a lovely place, really good. Lovely. Over there in that far side where I'm pointing there, there's some, you might maybe able to pick them up, there's some rushes. That's going to be nice, that, in, a, in a, about another another three or four weeks. That side you can't get a car around to, though, so. But I don't bother me, I've got better. This looks well as well. It's it's deeper in edges than it is art, for some strange reason. This looks nice, this, this edge. I've put a load of pellet I'm fishing probably about 40 yards I put plenty of pellet in and about a kilo of oil is now just really hoping to pull some into area it did a sturgeon yesterday that we're putting night before so that's a little bit strange, probably from stress of a, a restocking it. I should think that the reason that were caught. Beautiful place. Loads of sand martins, very rich. That looks nice and all that far side. <coughs> Beautiful. Right, if I have a vision, I'll. Keep you updated. Birds have been a little bit of a nightmare. Swan's not reaching my baits. Neither at Mallard, so that tells me that I'm, I'm fishing in water over over about three and a half, four foot. I'd say about three and a half, four foot. It's deeper than a swan's neck anyway. But tufties are getting down to it, like they always do. Right, I'll give you a nod if I have anything. Latest.